In InSight, you can also explore the impact of changing the thermal properties of the building envelope elements. InSight allows you to change the range of values being considered for the thermal properties of different constructions and quickly see the impact of these alternatives on the building's energy performance, providing helpful information to assist you in your design decision making. Some of the properties of building elements that can be modified in InSight include the window to wall ratio, the wall construction and roof construction properties, and the window glazing characteristics. Let's start by opening a Revit project to be used in this analysis. Open the building model, simple L building, schematic constructions Revit model. Next, let's view the InSight results for this model. If needed, generate insights for this model. Click the Analyze tab and click Generate Insights. Then click Optimize to access the results. Before beginning our analysis, let's select and apply the baseline scenario. Open the Scenarios tab, then select the baseline scenario to apply the saved assumptions. Next, let's view the potential effect of changing the window to wall ratio on some of our wall surfaces. Scroll down the InSight interface to view the window to wall ratio Western Walls Factor. Note that window to wall ratio is abbreviated WWR in the InSight interface. Note also that for the WWR factor, InSight offers separate factors for the walls facing each of the compass directions north, west, east, and south. Let's start by observing the range of window to wall ratios being considered in the current settings for the western walls. Click the factor to edit the settings for the window to wall ratio. Then hover the pointer over each of the points representing an option for the window to wall ratio factor to see the effect on the EUI mean or annual cost mean associated with that option. Next, let's select the range of values to be considered for the window to wall ratio. Drag the handles at the left and right ends of the factor range to select the window to wall ratio percentage to be considered in the analysis. Let's choose 65% for the window to wall ratio western walls factor. Note how the EUI mean or annual cost mean changes to reflect the new range of values for this factor. Also note how your EUI mean or annual cost mean compares to the ASHRAE 90.1 and Architecture 2030 baselines following this change. Let's close the window to wall ratio factor. And now let's view the potential effect of changing the thermal properties of the walls, roof, or window glass. Scroll down the inside interface to view the factor for the roof construction. You could follow similar steps to explore changes to the wall construction or the window glass thermal properties. Note that for window glass, inside offers separate factors for each of the compass directions, northwest, east, and south. Note the range of roof construction types being considered in the current settings. Click the factor to edit the settings. Hover the pointer over each of the points representing an option for that factor to see the effect on the EUI mean or annual cost mean associated with that option. Note that InSight provides slightly different wall and roof types than those available in Revit. When updating Revit to implement InSight's options, you should pick or modify the wall, roof, or glazing to provide similar thermal properties to the ones selected in InSight. Now let's select a range of values to be considered for the roof construction. Drag the handles at the left and right ends of the factor range to select a roof type to be considered in the analysis. Choose the R30 roof. Note how the EUI mean or annual cost mean changes to reflect the new range of values for this factor. Let's close this factor. And now we're ready to save a scenario to store our roof construction assumptions for easy comparisons. Select the Add Scenario button at the top right of the Model Viewer. Click the Action button, the three dots to the right of the untitled scenario name, then choose Rename from the pop-up menu to change the name of this scenario. Set the name of this scenario to R30 Roof Construction. 
Now we're ready to compare how the results have changed as we've made changes to the model assumptions. Scroll down to the Model History panel and compare the model changes. Note that while the EUI mean has stayed approximately the same value, the range of potential values has decreased as we've narrowed our selections for some of the most impactful factors. We can also track and compare our scenario results. Select the Scenario Compare button located at the top right of the Model Viewer to display a side-by-side -side comparison of all the scenarios saved. Hover over the bars in the Scenario Comparison panel to display the EUI mean or annual cost mean of the specific scenarios.